I used to follow him everywhere he goes to school to do his um, so-called workshop. And uh, we were using very, very low entry-level computer to do some sampling and some magic of uh, sounds that he can build up from the computer. And that was using the Creative Sound Blaster. You remember that, Mr. Q? Oh my goodness. So that's how I knew him and I learned how he managed to communicate the students and making beautiful sounds and sequencing it from the computer. So I'm sure I've met many of our friends that also uh, has respected Mr. Q since the early days of where we actually bring back a lot of good memories and nostalgic memories of synthesizers. So without further delay, put your hands together for Mr. Q Sin Sun. Thanks, Mike, for your nice words. Yeah. Um, okay, I'm Q, uh, and thank you so much for coming here. I think uh, this um, Synth Meet, okay, as uh, you have um, heard about it, it's uh, about not only about the performances here and all that, but I think it's about uh, you guys as well. It's a meeting where we hope to be able to see everyone as well as um, you know, to be able to mingle, talk, discuss, and, uh, and everything else uh, under the sun regarding synthesizers. Um, but uh, before I move into anything further, I would like to thank um, City Music yeah, for um, opening this space up, although space is uh, getting standing behind already. Uh, but uh, thank you very much you know, for the, all the folks in City Music and uh, for the opportunity to actually be able to meet uh, over here. Um, right, so. Uh, as you can see, okay, these are synthesizers okay, and these are also synthesizers. So uh, what are the differences? I mean, hopefully, you know, um, we are a kind of a small community of, of synthesizer enthusiasts uh, in Singapore and uh, with these kind of um, activities, I hope to be able to nurture up a, a community of young people who are enthusiasts, you know, interested in such things. Uh, do DIY, you know, make music, and you know, essentially everything electronic uh, in this sense. So um, we will kind of go through some of these things as from basic, okay, basic level. So for those of you who know some of this stuff, uh, you know, bear with us uh, because we're going to kind of introduce to everyone you know, what all this uh, does and how it is used and all that. Um, so what I have over here is. Um, essentially what I brought down from my uh, lab upstairs okay I, I teach in my lab it's upstairs on the third floor so I, and I teach synthesizers so uh, essentially it is a music technology school where these days I try to teach synthesizers uh, as well so these are some of the stuff here um, my two friends you know, David and John okay they are uh, they brought cases okay so the synthesizers are in a case uh, it's a little more portable Okay, mine I have to bring, uh, you know, several times and on a trolley and all that because it's not a, a portable type. It's more of a lab-based um, um, range of synths. Hey, Boston, I bought this from you, right? <laughs> yeah, I bought this from him, <laughs> this case, yeah. Okay, so uh, in any case, maybe before I, I go about, uh, you know, talking too much, uh, let me just play something okay, so that we can hear how these synthesizers work. Okay.